beautiful one guys so basically i'm just gonna simple jump into this this morning it's gonna be a super fast one it's not gonna be too um drying out this morning it's gonna be so easy and simple as you can see the topic of my video we're gonna talk about um, the full benefit of the bay leaf and the rosemary mixed together um a lot of people still uh, we know that a lot of people suffer from like giant Han, good morning. Thank you so much for coming on the show. A lot of people who are suffering from pain in their joint and different stuff. So that's why I want to give you the recipe this morning. So hopefully you guys will like the recipes. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also leave the comments in the description box. Alright. Yeah. Um... I just want to take the time to say good morning to each and every one of you guys who are watching so far. I really appreciate you guys' love. It's a little bit early, but I say I'm going to be doing this show very early this morning because, you know what I mean, I like to just get my audience up together in the morning. All right, now we're going to jump straight into it and we're going to talk about the rosemary and also the benefit. We all know that rosemary and the and, and bay leaf is very powerful two ingredients right there i'm always using them in my cooking and i do a lot of stuff with it so but i'm gonna show you how you can use the both two ingredients together this morning okay in the meantime i'm just making a cup of tea all right Yeah, so we all know that there's a lot of people who are suffering from giant pain, knee pain, back pain, um, a lot of pain. But the one thing I want to simply say to you, all right, you don't have to use it just for your back or for, your, for pain in your knee, in your joint. You can also use it like on your feet. You know, a lot of people, their feet is like a little bit like around the edge of your corner of your feet. You know what I mean? Sometimes when you don't go to the saloon or whatever, you don't get this time to do certain things. You can rub it there. Uh, so it's very good for that. Um, not only that, very good for spots on your skin. Try and use it on your skin for spots. Very good for like stretch mark on all these things. Try and use it for that. Don't be shy of yourself. All right. So I'm just going to give you a little bit of tweaking how to make this one this morning. Okay. So we got two ingredients, three ingredients we're going to be using. We got bay leaf and rosemary. All right. Now, the only way I'm going to be doing this this morning, is I'm going to make it like a bambaroon. So I'm going to put this. I don't know if you guys have one of these at home. Do not put the oil on the pot, in the pot, and try and make it that kind of way. All right? Um, right here, I'm doing... Um, this is what I've been drinking right now. I'm doing a, like a seven-day detoxing green tea. So if you never did that before... I introduce you say this is another recipe we can also do in the morning like a seven day detoxing tea so i get my tea bag put it into it and pour some hot water you can drink it this twice a day or three times a day for the green tea all right i mentioned it yesterday morning to show I, yesterday guys which i show you um here it is it's a super detox tea it is a peppermint and it's um it doesn't got no preservative or not like inside of it all right yeah nothing like that inside of it so it's just natural herbs in this one so i'm just doing a super green tea peppermint detox so i will be drinking this probably two to three times a day you don't have to do a chef record to do but if you are a person who are looking for a very healthy lifestyle i would tell you to jump on board and follow chef record cooking okay so it's a super green tea and i'm gonna be doing this for seven days all right so I'll be drinking like probably two to three times a day right here. But yeah, this is it right here. And that's how it look. I do not have any sugar, any sweetener or any honey to it. I just drink it natural like this. All right. So let's repeat again. I don't know if you guys can get this super green tea with peppermint. It's a detoxing tea. All right. So I'm trying out this for seven days to see how that react on my body. All right. Yeah, let's put this one side. And let's get back this over here. Now, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this right here 
inside of this pot. So if you're making rice pudding or rice porridge, this is the best way you can do it to put one of these things in the pot. That means you don't burn your rice pudding. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm going to pour some hot water. So I just boil my kettle. All right, lovely. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm going to get my kettle, my stove on, sorry. All right. Then now what I'm gonna do, is to put this into the water like this but I think this may a little bit too much so let's pour it a little bit of the water lovely so we come back here and see perfect so you want to make sure the water is evil with this thing right here all right yeah so once you do it like that kind of way then what we're gonna do So this is the container which you're going to be using to fill the oil into. Okay, so hopefully I might, I'm going to measure it out. That means I don't do any mistake with the oil. Okay, so this is the boards. So if you know the container where you're going to be used to put the oil in, I would encourage you to measure it out. Okay, guys, that means I don't waste your oil. Especially if you're using a good extra virgin olive oil. You know, that means I don't waste it. All right. Then, so what you want to do is to get your bay leaf and break it up. All right, break it up finely like this. So what you want to do, you want to use this at least 10 days. All right. Just 10 days is pretty good to, to go with it. Um, I will put the benefit of the bay leaf and the rosemary in the description box for you. Nice one. Then we're going to get the rosemary if you don't have the fresh rosemary you can use a dry one but I like to use a fresh rosemary So I'm going to turn the macro a little bit. Alright. So as I notice what's going on right there. It's boiling up a little bit. So. But I turn the macro a little bit. Like you don't want to. You do not want to burn yourself guys. To be honest with you. <coughs> Sorry. So you just want to eat to penetrate through the olive oil with the rosemary for a few minutes. But try and not make the water get into the oil. So if you guys have access like something like this at home, and you're gonna see the oil. So it's like it's getting hot and it's getting thinner, so it's cooking it. Getting the flavor from the, the rosemary and also the bay leaf.
So as I said guys, the only can try this recipe at all, this remedy. All right, this home remedy, trust me. And nothing can beat home remedy. Nothing on this world can beat home remedy. So if you're at home and you can get this recipe, trust me. And as I say, you don't even need to use it just for giant pain. You can use it less for a lot of stuff. And as the guys can see the other day, I have a little black spot right here. So and I've been using the oil and look at the spot just disappear. So I, I know, although most of us skin are different, but you just only can try. All right. And we all know that olive oil is very good for us. Well, that's looking really good guys to be honest with you That's looking good. Perfect. And it can smell the rosemary from the oil. Smell really amazing. So guys, you do not want to just put the, what you might say, why not just put the oil in the pot and put it on the stove? You do not want to do that, okay? Because the oil will burn. You don't want to use a burn oil. So the best way to do it is this. Just like if you're at home and you're cooking like a pudding, certain kind of pudding, and you don't want your, your pot to be burned and your oil to or your anything to burn this is the best way to do it and you take your time and cook it so as you can see the rosemary is start to change color i don't know if you guys have seen what's going on that's why i'm trying to make you guys can see and, and i'm trying to do it a little bit longer that's so you guys can see exactly what's going on right here you can even use it for your year and all them stuff there for your skull of your ear, run the edge of your ear. There's a lot of stuff you can do with this guys at home. Trust me. It was amazing to know. Exactly. So you just want to cook the rosemary and the bay leaf into the oil like this and strain it off. So you will see what I'm talking about when I finish. Oh, you got a little bit sit inside of this. All right. But trust me, it's a powerful remedy, guys. Home remedy. You don't have to just use it for... Just so I say you want to use it just only for your for giant pain. You can use it for a lot of stuff on your skin. Can help to remove your spots on your skin. Use it on your belly mark. Whatever you want to use it. But it's a perfect home remedy for you. I got one more which I'm going to be sharing with you. Also. Uh, but another day I will be making this. So as soon as I finish this one off. I'm not suffering from giant pain. But I just like to use the aisle for my purpose. Just like use it on my feet. You know what I mean? In my ear and my skin and my hand and all of these places. So as you can see, the color of the rosemary is changed. So that's what you're looking for. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah, perfect guys. That is so perfect. I love it. Alright. 
Guys, we only have 38 person like the video. We got like so many people watching. Why you don't wanna like the video? Please share some love. Share some love. Please share the video and share some love. If you like what I'm doing. Alright, now as you can see, so I'll wait it, I'll wait till the color of the rosemary change. Alright? And that's it. You saw the rosemary change. And it's running like free, freely. So that's what you want to see. That means to tell us that the oil is very hot. All right, all right. So now, now is it? You do not want to make it cool in the pot or anything. All right, you do not want to cool in the pot. Don't cool it in the pot. I'll show you what to do next. All right, now. So this is what you're gonna do next. Okay, let's come this side with it. All right. Uh, Lenin, thank you so much for coming on the show. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. So we're going to come over this side, guys, to be honest with you. All right. So this is the side that we're going to be using. All right. Now, I'm going to turn off the cooker. Please share the video, guys, and please like the video. I just don't understand why you guys doesn't want to like the video. Share some gratitude and some love. All right. Now. So once you, you boil it off, all right? All right, this is what you wanna do. You wanna pour it off like this. All right? Yeah, you wanna pour it off like this. You wanna get it when it's really hot. All right, we'll see if any more left inside of it. Lovely. This is a puff. It's, uh, it's gonna be a little bit warm. Ah, uh, yeah, depends how, you, how long you have it on the air one for. But it's a little bit hot at the moment. All right, guys. So you have to be careful. Okay? Now, to be honest with you, it, this uh, this is just amazing. I'm sure you don't even know. I got one more recipe which I'm gonna be sharing with you, just like this. But so what I'm gonna say to you is a little bit hot at the moment, but yeah, it's a little bit hot. So what you wanna do? Put a little bit into your hand, all right, and then what you wanna do? Rub it anyway. If it's here, so it's pain in you, you wanna do this for at least ten days. All right, remember the other day I told you this little spot right here, so I've been to keep rubbing the olive oil on it, and it's just taking the time, it's disappear, it's removing the spot from my finger. All right, so you want to just rub it right there. All right. So you have to be careful because you don't want to burn yourself, okay? Make sure you check it. Put a little bit in your hand and just rub it on your hand. If it's here, so giving you a giant problem or your knee, you just want to rub it right there like this. Okay. Anyway, giving you that beautiful, that problem, that's pain. You just want to use this oil and rub it right there. All right. Rub it on your hand. You don't have, and you will smell the flavor from the rosemary in the oil. And also the bay leaf, very strong in it. And the oil feel totally different. Like you just feel amazing on your skin. So if you do this, even before you go to your bed at night, one well, five minutes, or uh, when you just come out the shower, you just rub it on your hand, wherever you're giving you that pain. You know what I mean? Rub it in your back. You know what I mean? All of those places also you can do. But trust me, it's a powerful home remedy. And as I say, you have to be careful because it's going to be really warm. All right? You might have said, how long this can last for? This, this little bottle right here, you can use this up to about, for about, say, five to about 10 days the least. It all depends how heavy your hand is. So you can, 10 days is pretty good with that one. All right, it's gonna be a little bit warm. So as I say, remember, this one is a bay leaf and rosemary oil, all right? So this one, you can just simple, mix it together, both of them together and just do what I just did a while ago and just use it on your skin, all right? If you're suffering from any pain, you don't have to suffer from pain to use it. As I say, you can use it on your feet and you know I mean, many places on your body. You can use it, all right? So you want to leave it for it to cool. And then once it's cool down, 
you know and you can use it because it's very hot at the moment and it's need to cool down okay that's hot oil that will burn you so just be careful because of health and safety all right guys yeah so here it is another one from chef ricardo and also i will be coming with another one when this one is finished that one is going to be totally different you're going to love that one guys all right but anyway if you like this ideas please let me know in the description box and remember to go over to my website chefricardo.co.uk and download the book to your phone and support Chef Ricardo. 2.50. All right, 95% half for Mother's Day. Here's his name. Good morning. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. All right. So if you like this kind of recipes, home remedy, please let me know. And if you want to get in touch with Chef Ricardo, go over to my Instagram page, Chef Ricardo Cooking, and follow me. All right, guys. Leave your comments and as I said, we've got a lot more recipes and a lot more ideas will be coming for you from Chef Ricardo. This can last. Do not put it in your fridge. All right. Put it at a warm place in your cupboard or in your toiletry in section in the bathroom. All right. And use it on a regular basic. All right, guys. Yeah. For, good for your skin. But thank you so much for watching. I know that many people's skin may be allergic to the oil or to rosemary or to the to the um, bay leaf so if you know your skin are allergic to this you know what i mean do not use it okay because we don't want anything to happen to you we want you to be looking after looking after yourself at home but thank you so much for watching stay tuned in and have a blessed day and i will catch you with another one very soon big up my facebook audience every time who's supporting chef ricardo cooking i really appreciate every one of you guys 100 percent on my youtube channel thank you so much guys for who are listening and not saying anything we love you know Today's, no, first of all, before I even go any further, today's Friday. All right, guys, today's Friday. Uh, this is weekend. Okay. So big up all of the people who are going to work, just coming from work, who are just dropping off the kids them to school, whatever you're doing at this moment. You know what I mean? Whatever you on your phone, whether you're making a call, whether you're watching TV, whatever you're doing at this minute, you know what happened? Thank you so much, and I pray that the Lord will continue to bless you, guide you, and protect you. I may not know you, but trust me, by faith, I believe the Lord will bless you and guide you and protect you and provide for you and your family. So the beautiful thing I want to say to you, guys, today is Friday. Have a wonderful day. Have a beautiful day. Look after yourself, and you know what happened? I'm from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate every one of you guys who take the time and watch the video and share the video we love you all all right so the most important thing today stay strong okay today is friday stay strong it's, it's weekend and i know a lot of people may want to do something for mother's day look after mommy and you know what i mean have a blessed day and stay strong and look after yourself and look after your family and look after your kids and whatever you do today make it be a very successful day for you guys all right have a blessed day man May the Lord guide you and protect you. And I will catch you with another one. I'm out. Bye-bye.